everyone, Tiana Alexandra here and I am back with another video and in today's video I am going to be showing you the limited edition Sugar Pill Little Twin Star Collaboration Makeup Collection. Oh, I feel like I should be whispering because it's just so delicate and beautiful. Right, let's just get into it. So, I've wanted this for quite some time. It was released this year, 2018. And I do believe it's coming to the end of its lifespan, as it is limited edition. Um, I think sometime in December it will be discontinued. And I was getting worried because I like I, I need this, um, but I did get it in the end. So it comes in this sleeve. The packaging needs attention, very much so. So here it says, very clear, limited edition. Here we have Kiki and Lala, Sugar Pill Little Twin Star. And here is just uh, ingredients and such. Let's turn over to the back. Let me, let me read to you what it says. <clears throat> Kiki and Lala travel to Earth to learn how to be the best, shinier stars they can be. Now you can shine bright with them. The twin stars have teamed up with the cutest cult beauty brand, Sugar Pill, to create this limited edition collection which features all new shades in the ultra pigmented, high performance, cruelty free formulas they are known for. Get ready to sparkle. How lovely. So here just shows what we have. Comes with the eyeshadow set, the two lip colours and the bag. You can buy these two individually, but in order to receive the bag, um, you need to get the set. And it also comes with the box, which of course is just lovely. Vegan cruelty free, because we love bunnies. There's their, you know, socials. It has this beautiful pastel purple colour. And it's, it's, I mean, it's hard to see with the naked eye, but it's also hard to see on camera, but you can see the outlines of Lala here and Kiki on the other side. Um in like this raised, kind of rubberized, shiny material. Here, you can see if I go like this. And then up front, we have the twins, Kiki and Lala. And then this is, this is kind of like embossed, texturized gold. And then on the back, we just have that same shine. And then on the side, we have some more lettering. It's just very sweet. And the sides are bare. So. Let's open this. Okay, you ready? I have looked inside it already. So <laughs> my reaction was a breathlessness one. And it is magnetised. How lovely. Right. Here we go. Wow. Isn't that lovely? Isn't that just beautiful? So I'm just going to tilt you up slightly. Just to show you this part. It's like every, every inch of this from the box to the sleeve, the design, it, it's, it's all very unified and well made. This is a very quality product and it's just gorgeous. So. I'll take you back down so we can have a look at the contents of the box. So, first up, we just have a card here, a little promo for some of that other makeup. We have a card, a uh, promotion for the actual set that we own. Do you know what I would have loved? Um, you know, I'll, I'll get, I'll get to that. This isn't a review, I'm just showing it to you, but I also like to share my thoughts. Now I think we should uh, start with this palette. 
it. I will be doing you um, some swatches as well. So, same story. Have the details all around. I'm just going to close the box just for purposes of focusing my camera. <laughs> A little bit easier for you. So here we have um, the design, the twins on either side, always sweet. And then this plastic sleeve on the back. Oh, how beautiful. I mean, this is a sleeve. It's a plastic sleeve of an eyeshadow, which is just usually very easily discarded, where it's like I, I don't want to throw any of it away. It's so gorgeous. I'll have to deal with that in my own time. So here we have the colours. I'll just take you through them. Cloud, cloud Maker, foiled. Star Ribbon is a matte one. Twinkle is foiled. Dream Dust and, and Sky Candy are frost. And Wish is foiled. We'll talk about the colours a little bit more when we get into the palette. And here we have the same sort of text about them. These six delightful shades come in a variety of luxurious textures in an ultra pigmented long wearing formula. And here they are, I don't know, getting ready for bed or something. How adorable. Now, in your opinion, Sanrio fans, I think we can assume Lala is a girl. Now, is Kiki a girl with short blue hair? Or is Kiki a boy? In your opinion. I like to view them as kind of either twin brother and brother and sister or just humanoid aliens that are genderless these are the colors wow what i love about this palette is it actually has the name of the colors written on the palette now it is an extra step i understand why not all companies do it um but i just like that extra detail so let's do a couple of swatches shall we you know there's only six colors let's just swatch the whole thing they could have very easily made this 12 colors um, because these pans are very large they could have just halved um, but they obviously didn't choose to do that I'm just gonna leave that there while I show you the colors so this one is cloud maker oh my goodness I think I stuck my finger in a bit hard there So it's a lot more, it's not as scary on the finger <laughs> as it is on the hand. I was getting a little bit worried. And this is a foiled finish. So it's a lot more dainty. It's not like a uh, ultra matte kind of design. It's much more soft. This is Dream Dust. So that first one's a silver. This one is um, kind of a taupe colour. Here we have Star Ribbon. Kind of a very bright turquoise. Next is Sky Candy. This is a very fun rosy pink. Very pretty. Now these two, I just need to wipe off my fingers. These two I am probably most excited about. Let's just do them two at a time. So Twinkle is gold and Wish is copper. They're very soft. They're very, very soft. Let's just do these two. Those two are probably the most impressive. Um, they come off very, very nicely. Nice colour payoff. The, uh, the other four colours are kind of more gentle. These two are very bold. Now, for a palette, 
we have only um, one matte shade. The rest are either frosted or foiled. Um, I know how I feel about that. I have no problem with that. I rarely use matte colours. I love shimmer. I always have shimmery eyes um, and kind of sparkly. However, I know a lot of people don't like the shimmers. They prefer a fully matte palette with perhaps one or two shimmery shades. So that is something to think about. Um, I'm really upset that I've like ruined cloud maker. But you know, makeup is to be used. That is something to consider. However, I understand what they were going for. They are from, I don't know, space? They're not really very space-like characters. They're not futuristic. They're from, they're from like a cloud land, outer space, but soft and gentle. So I understand why they might want to go with more sparkly colors. Back into the box. We're going to look at the lipsticks now. I'm going to remove both of them. So here we have the lipsticks. Let's start with the pink. This is Lala, the pink twin. The colour, the shade is just called Lala. The tube is like any other sugar pill lipstick. It has the gorgeous um this same sort of lilac colour that's going through everything and the golden stars. Really beautiful. Very special, very special. I'm just gonna give it a quick shake. I'll give you a swatch on my hand. Let me just wipe off the eyeshadow swatches. Here you can see, I really like the sugar pill um, applicators. They're angled and quite firm. I'm just going to give this a sniff. Now, I have smelled this before. It smells like lemonade. Oh, I don't know if I'm getting it wrong. Like, it could be something else, but... To me, it smells like... Kind of like a Fanta Fruit Twist or a Fizzy Orange. It's fruity, tropical, and it smells fizzy. So I'm just gonna uh, put this on. How gorgeous. Now, I'm not one for pink lipsticks. This is, um, I'm just gonna look at it with my own eyes. Oh, wow, okay. In, uh, from my naked eye, it is, a lot more Barbie. In the camera, it looks a lot more warm. Um, I think that's probably just my lighting that I have going on. Um, you know, soft lighting. But yeah, it's a lot more cool in person. But I don't really wear pink lipstick. I don't actually have any. So it is nice to add one to the collection. But of course, I still think it's beautiful. Let's go on to the blue. This shade is simply called Kiki. Now this is a colour, I think a lot of um, other people that I've seen do this video is um, kind of the opposite to me. They are a little bit frightened by this colour and would not wear it. But you know me. I love, uh, I love blue lipsticks. Same scent. This one has a little bit more of a thick consistency, but they are both extremely moussey and velvety. Here they are together. So let's take a look at that blue colour. In person, just looking at it with my own eye, it is a lot more cold, a lot cooler, 
where in the camera it's looking a lot more warm and a bit deeper. It's a beautiful bluish green, kind of like a sea foam green. The closest thing I have is probably Huntington Beach, but again, you can see there's no comparison. These are very unique colours. And I cannot wait. I can't wait to wear uh, Kiki. Will I wear Lala? I mean, if I was probably losing my mind, I would try it on. But I would definitely not, um, <laughs> I would not wear it. I'm just not a pink person. When it comes to makeup, eyeshadow, yeah, I can do pink, but um, lipstick, it's not for me. Now, this is the final item, the makeup bag. And I'm just gonna take this opportunity to remove this insert. It held everything nicely. And here we just have the box, which has the same quilted design. Now, this bag is beautiful. We have Kiki and Lala. Here, to me, they look like brother and sister. We have their teddy friend on the moon. Stars and clouds. And again, the gold design with this mauve kind of pinkish purple, very light colour. Here we just have some licensing, Sanrio, and then on the other side, Sugar Pill. We have some hardware here. I'm just gonna take off the plastic. Here we have the little zipper. And it's a gold zip. On the inside, some silica gel. Don't eat this. Really pretty. And the inside is clear, but it's kind of frosted. As if, I don't know, kind of like vision in a dream. You know, when you're asleep and you're dreaming, you can see things, but they're not always as clear as they might be. Just going with that soft focus, gentle, delicate motif that's across everything. Um, it's really lovely. So, here is the bag. I'm just going to pop the makeup in the bag. The palette. The pink lipstick. And the blue lipstick. Here they all are. And I mean, you've got room in there for multiple other things. If I was going to make any changes to this, um, it would probably just be the addition of something else. I know you get an eyeshadow palette with six shades, two lipsticks, the box and the bag. However, I would have loved to have seen um, a non-makeup item in terms of actual product, perhaps a brush, um, a unicorn brush, or, um, you know, we see their magic wands quite a lot throughout the design. Um, here we see Lala's wand here. You know, maybe a brush that was um, inspired by the wand or um, a mirror. I would have loved to have had a limited edition Little Twin Stars mirror um, that is either star-shaped or just circular with the twins on. I would have really, that would have made this for me a 10 out of 10. Um, I would just have liked to have had that extra item just to feel completely spoiled and like it's something completely special. Um, however, without that item, I still feel like this is extremely special and very lovely. And makeup that can be cherished as well as practically used. Anyway, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed um, taking a look at this Sugar Pill Little Twin Stars limited edition set. Let me know down below what your favourite item from this collection was and if you have it or anything similar to it. That's it for this video and I'll see you next time. Goodbye. <laughs>